What's up guys, welcome back to another Madden 15 video guys. Today we're going to cover uh, a video explaining the ins and out of uh, spacing and passing and things like that. One of the things I really want to focus on today is uh, progression reads, but really uh, field reads. And it's a different way to look at uh, passing the football in Madden 15. I'm going to use my uh, favorite play in Madden 15, the PA post from the Shotgun Bunch Week. It's my uh, bread and butter play. Like you see, 168 calls. I call it a lot. Average about 10 yards a play. Um, also, real quick, I want to apologize for uh, being gone so much and uh, not posting regularly. Uh, that will be uh, beginning to change as I get the videos, uh, the video editor fixed and uh, some things like that. So uh, that will change. We do have a lot of Mad 16 content coming for you. We do have a guide we're going to be doing. We're going to be showing you guys a couple of things uh, leading up to that. But here's the PA post. What we want to look at uh, here is we want to read areas of the field. And so we'll just set this up like we normally run it. And you're starting to see first we're going to look to the left cornerback. And based off what we see on the left cornerback, that left kind of area of the field is going to tell us, all right, is the left side open? And then we're going to look to the middle. Is the middle of the field open? And then we're going to look to the right. Is the middle is the right of the field open? Upon uh, snapping the ball, we see that the middle of the field underneath is open. And so we're going to hit our square receiver, who we know is going to be running that short underneath route. And uh, like I said, it takes uh, the reason that this is a little more advanced, in my opinion, is um, is because um, you have to know where your receivers are going uh, before you actually throw the football, and you can't take time to always look to see that they are going there. Okay, so here we're going to look at this one more time, and uh, here we're going to see that the uh, right side of the field is open, and so we'll hit that little out route to Des Bryant. Uh, on the outside there. But this is just a mindset. Uh, there's going to be a lot more on it later. Uh, what I really wanted to do in this video is kind of give you a taste of it. Uh, this is going to be kind of the primary uh, offensive tip that I'm going to be doing uh, in Madden 16 and Madden 15 uh, because in my opinion it's the most effective. Um, what we want to look at here and what we're talking about is we're talking about transcending uh, traditional uh, reading uh, projections and, and transcending traditional uh, ways to read the defense. We like to read here based off of where the defense is going post-snap and not even looking at our receivers to see if they're open. We're simply looking at the defenders. And so here, when I look to the right and see that blitz coming, I'm going to hit that slant because I know that it's coming in behind where that blitzer was. And so you see how that works there. And we throw in behind the blitz to get a big gain. Now, there are certain things we're going to be teaching about pre-snap reads, post-snap reads, that thing. But what I want you to get focused on is have a couple key defenders um, Typically, I use the uh, left side safety, the right side safety, and then the right linebacker on both sides or something like that. But a couple key defenders, and so you're looking to whether they blitz or they go deep or wherever they go. And here, uh, I expect a blitz, and so I, I look to my, my slant route because the blitz was coming off that right edge. But just look for a couple key defenders, and then what you're going to look for uh, off that as well is um, how does this... How does this play into uh, where they go post-snap? So, for example here, we're going to key in on this left side corner. And based off, if he goes, if he backs up at the snap of the ball, we're going to hit DeMarco Murray. Here he backs up at the snap of the ball, we're going to hit DeMarco Murray, and we got that big gain because the gap of the defense, the defense is not there. Uh, and so we don't even have to look to see if DeMarco is open. We know because we know where all the rest of the players are going defensively. Now here I'm going to key the right side linebacker, and if he goes out on his own, then I'm going to look to the middle of the field. If he stays down, then I'm going to look to Jason Witten. Here he goes out on his own, so I look to the middle of the field, and uh, Cole Beasley would have been open. I tried to touch it over uh, Devin McCourty, but unfortunately I wasn't able to do that. Uh, Romo is not the most accurate of passers um, in this game, but here you see I get it really effectively. So. So that's just kind of the idea. Uh, I just want to present it to you and let you guys see it uh, and just kind of talk, get some dialogue going. And I wanted to get a video up because I haven't been able to do, uh, unfortunately, just because of my schedule and because of uh, my computer not working properly. I haven't been able to post very many videos this season. Um, 
Well, we are going to have a couple things for you. We're going to have a, a nice little free guide we're going to be doing uh, to open Madden 16. It's going to be with Madden 15 content so that you can see it. And uh, that way it's out before Madden 16 drops. And then what we're going to do is we're going to have a paid e-guide for both offense and defense. Uh, it's going to teach you how to be a better player uh, and how to be one of the better players in the game. If you follow these simple tactics, uh, you will be one of the best players in Madden, uh, Madden 16. Thank you so much for your time. I hope you enjoyed these videos, guys. If you like this content, let me know. If you don't like this content, let me know, and I'll change it up. Uh, but for right now, this is uh, kind of the thing I want to be doing. I want to be talking about Madden 16. Uh, we're going to have uh, some videos coming out about some, some news and some things like that going on. Uh, but for right now...